a nice color. You can't give a compliment and then look at me like that. It's just like, it's like defeats the purpose. It's like me going, nice face. Wow. That's not a compliment. It's like, uh, thank God. Is that? <laughs> With the coffee. Oh, oh God, I need it. I've been up since four. I'm thinking about moving to New York. So I really thought it would be a good idea to visit my sisters. I haven't talked to Louie about moving because I'm still going back and forth with it. I'm nervous doing long distance will ruin our relationship. I know myself and I'm very bad with these kind of conversations. See where you're at in a week because it all may change. Okay. I feel like this is a great opportunity to experience the city. So, plan today, we're going out tonight? Absolutely. Yeah, I think, yeah. oh, just, just a cocktail. So just to wet the lips. Wet the lips? Ew. <laughs> That's not even a phrase. Ew. I'm sorry. God. It just came out. I can't hide. It's oh, okay. Cute. My tits gonna pop out any second. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Thank you. Thank you. New York, it's fun and it's lightning and it gives me energy and I, I really do need that. Yay, Sophia, keep drinking. No problem. You are Maybe. so loose when you drink, I love it. I feel like you would be better if you had like nine of these before taking a speech. Was this your lure to get me out here, get me a little tipsy and convince me? The fact that Children's Hospital asked me to be a guest speaker is Probably one of the biggest honors I'll ever have in my life. I've had two open heart surgeries and one of them was at Children's Hospital. I'm so incredibly honored. The problem is the gala for Children's Hospital is a huge event with hundreds of people and I'm picking out my nails. Talking about public speaking just makes me like, ugh. The last time Sophia gave a speech was at another heart charity years and years ago. She literally had a nervous breakdown and was crying at the table and couldn't get up and give the speech. She could say about two words and then ran off. I just, oh my, I just hate public speaking. I, I just can't. Sophia, it's not like you're giving a speech about quantum physics. You're talking about something you know and that is personal in your story. I love you guys for encouraging me, but I'm terrified. There's like no way I will actually do that speech. Ever. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, tomatoes. Whoa. whoa. I'm really disappointed in Sophia because this is such a good opportunity and she's throwing it away because of some fear. I just don't want to butcher it for people that have saved me and I can't, you know, do at least this back. Like, it's just. Can you guys just understand what I'm going through and just let me. I can just understand what I said. Like, no, which you guys aren't listening thing. to me. You guys aren't no, hearing no, my no. thoughts. Boo. Boo. Yeah, go fix your hair. I don't want to do it. <laughs> I don't want to mess up.